Would now be a bad time to tell you that loss came on the one year anniversary of Brian Burke getting fired. Mother f ah! What? Are you serious? <laughs> Mind blown. We need idea. <laughs> I'm dumb. Deli hard. We get to the game, please. Ah! Why? What's it gonna take, huh? So, the Leafs lose 6-1 to the Carolina Hurricanes. And to the thousands of you that predicted John Michael Isles would score his first of the season in this game, congratulations. Come collect your prize of pure misery. For people who don't think the Leafs are actually cursed, keep in mind that not only did Lyle score on the Leafs this season, Mike Koska scored on the Leafs this season. And that makes me very... Yeah. After Lyle scored that 4-1 goal, I'm like, light him up. Just light him up, guys. But then I realized James was in net, and I'm just screaming like Shia LaBeouf. Optimus! Like that Simpsons episode with the burger guy. Stop! He's already dead. Last night, we recorded a brand new episode of the Panago Pizza Steve Dangle podcast during the game. I don't usually do this, but here's a little snippet. Replay a Steve Dangle podcast replay. But with this team and the problems with it, you know this is wrong. What problems? All the problems. Oh. Any problem you could possibly have, this team has. There's no problems out. There's so many problems. There's no problem. <laughs> Cold, Colton Orr's in the lineup. He'll take care of any problem. That's right. Have. The sheriff. Yeah, the sheriff. The sheriff sheriff you know Colton. Because <laughs> if you... I... <laughs> Why when you're I, down 4 one, you want to fight. That? You want to fight. Well, uh, you know what's weird? Because uh, teams are teams are teams teams get fired up by that sort of thing, right? Mm -hmm. um, at least good teams do. I'm looking at the penalty summary here. And, uh, and uh, you've got to be joking me. I was looking for if there's been a penalty in this game. You know who scored the 4-1 goal? I'm going to give you guys a... Uh, <laughs> oh, God, I just looked. Oh, man. Is this bad? <laughs> John Michael Lyles! <laughs> No. <laughs> You're joking. <laughs> oh. A duck! <laughs> this team is incurably. <laughs> oh my god! The Steve Dangle Podcast. Full episodes available on iTunes and SoundCloud. Search Steve Dangle. If you listen to the actual podcast, there's no bleeps. Not for me, anyway. Adam has a weird condition that every time he swears, a beep comes out. It's a medical condition. I bet you feel bad now. So hey, scratching Jake Gardner. Don't do that. As long as we're on the topic. The guy's second on the Leafs in ice time. I saw some people go, well, he didn't earn that ice time. Carlisle gave it to him. Either way, he goofed. You look around the NHL at some of the guys who are second on their team in ice time. Most of them, not, not crap. Alex Edler, Dennis Seidenberg, Brent Seabrook, P.K. Subban, Chris Letang, just to name a few. Admittedly the best ones, but go ahead and check out the full list. I list them all off on the podcast, and you tell me if that sounds stupid. Spoiler alert, it's stupid! What message are you sending him other than you have the power to bench him? What's Carlisle proving? I'm willing to let this team be garbage to prove a point? No, what's the panic, guys? The Leafs just fell out of a playoff spot for the first time this season. I'd be more optimistic about it if we hadn't been predicting this downfall since the Leafs were 10 and 4. Reimer, Bernier, almost anyone who's not a goalie on this team deserves better. The fans deserve better. The Leafs are the richest team in the sport and it's not close. What could they be doing differently to utilize that? The coach is a Norris Trophy winning defenseman. Correct. Stanley Cup winner. But it's 2014 and during a timeout he's screaming at the players with a marker board. Ron Wilson got a lot of criticism but at least he used the iPads and stuff. But to answer the question what do the Leafs do, I think they start with a new coach. But it might be too late to do that right away since they let him make so many personnel decisions. Gravo? Ah, here's like 20 mil or whatever in a buyout. Doesn't count towards the cap. Whatever. Pissing hundies. Clark MacArthur? Ah, go be one of the leading scorers for a divisional rival. See if we give a hoot. Do I keep or? or McLaren. Why not both? Hey! I'm losing it. And so are the Leafs. Click like, click subscribe, and if you want to know how I really feel, check out the brand new Panago Pizza Steve Dangle podcast. iTunes, SoundCloud, FeedBurner, we're on all that. But earmuffs, kids.